NASA, the U.S. Air Force, and the U.S. Navy concluded their tests recovering the new Orion space capsule. The team experienced complications handling the lines that secure the capsule inside the well deck of the USS San Diego. The test simulates the recovery after the capsule splashes down in the Pacific Ocean at the end of its first space flight, Exploration Flight Test 1, in September. The challenges demonstrated why it's important to conduct these tests in the actual environment the spacecraft will encounter. We learned a lot. We had some successes and failures in the tests that we did, but that's why we test. So the ones that didn't, didn't go perfectly, uh, those are the ones we really learned a lot. And uh, the whole engineering team learned a ton about how the vehicle behaves in a ship like this in the well deck with a lot of water in there. Um, it's very challenging to control. Uh, much harder than we expected, so we're going to have to go back and make a few changes and uh, come up with a better solution so that we can actually put humans in there. Orion is America's newest spacecraft that will take astronauts to destinations not yet explored by humans, including an asteroid and Mars. It will have an emergency abort capability, sustain the crew during space travel, and provide safe re-entry from deep space. Reporting from Naval Air Station North Island, I'm Staff Sergeant Pete Ising.